Welcome to Posture Practice Research. We'll be talking about a new study finding links between low back pain, spinal manipulation, and a very important muscle called the multifidus. My name is Dr. Stephen Weiniger. I'm author of Stand Taller, Live Longer, and Anti-Aging Strategy. And we're going to be talking about a new study that came out in October 2011 in the prestigious journal Spine. And it talks about the potential for posture exercise to improve low back pain. This is something that will be especially of interest to certified posture exercise professionals. Study is preliminary investigation of the mechanisms and underlying the effects of a manipulation, exploration of a multivariate model, including spinal stiffness, multifidus recruitment, and clinical findings. And this has implications for chiropractic as well as posture exercise. And for clinicians who use both, the connection between the two is really, really interesting and provocative in terms of what it says about how the combination can improve low back pain. The study was a small but well done study that had strict criterion for inclusion. There were no people that were, as that were asymptomatic. Everybody was having some measure of low back pain. However, it was at most 16 days long. There were no pain past the knee. The people had no psychological uh, overlays per the fear avoidance questionnaires that were done. On palpation by trained examiners, there was a posterior anterior stiffness on at least one lumbar segment, and prone hip internal rotation range of motion was over 35 degrees in at least one hip. They used a machine to measure the spinal stiffness before and at the end of the one-week test. And they also used ultrasound to actually measure the thickness of the deep multifidus muscle um, at the low back level as well. And they used a spinal manipulation te technique bilateral. They saw people two times over a one-week time frame. And at the end of the study, they compared all the different findings. And on comparing it, they found that people that had an improvement in their spinal stiffness after a spinal manipulation therapy and adjustment, they also were the ones that had a better oswestry score. They, report, they reported feeling better one week afterwards. In other words, people that had less spinal stiffness immediately post were doing better one week later. And from the study, immediate improvements in lumbar multifidus recruitment were highly related to recruitment changes at the one week follow-up even when no spinal manipulation was provided, suggesting that this facilitation is not transient and may be enhanced by combining spinal manipulative therapy with exercise interventions designed to promote lumbar multifidus function. This is huge. To review basic anatomy, the multifidus are the deep muscles between the vertebrae. Each multifidus only travels between one vertebra and the one above and below it, and along with the diaphragm, the transverse abdominis and the pelvic floor, they provide the deep core muscles stabilizing between the middle two posture zones, the torso and the pelvis. Your posture is how your body balances the head over the torso, over the pelvis, over the lower extremities. And when the multifidus is shown to be weak or not engaging properly, it affects how you can balance the torso over the pelvis, which in turn affects your posture. This is one of the things that we talked about in Stand Tall and Live Longer, how assessing posture can help people to find the mechanical weak link. And by addressing that clinically, you can improve things like back pain, neck pain, stiff joints, and even headaches. And the beginning of this is creating posture consciousness from a clinical point of view and seeing what kind of adaptations and compensations have occurred, which ties into multifidus function as well. The posture practice model that we talk about is teaching people how to localize fine motions such as lumbar multifidus, beginning with balance, then progressing with alignment targeted exercises, and then progressing with balance and alignment to use a ball to move the body in three dimensions with control from the core to find the weak links in the body's kinetic chain. And the posture professional protocols of balance alignment motion are designed to train the fine motor contraction that is often lost with low back pain and that this study has demonstrated is essential 
to improving when there is a problem with back pain. With BodyZone.com, we train professionals to be certified posture exercise professionals. PosturePractice.com has more information. CPEPs it locally can be found by looking at BodyZone.com. And these people teach the ideas and the exercises from Stan Tall of Longer. They've been to live seminars. They've been to webinars. They've been to online training. And they've been tested to do the strong posture exercises with proficiency. If you're a posture professional, take a look at posturezone.com for tools for posture practice, as well as more information about CPEP. And if you're a member of the public, find someone to help you strengthen your posture. Look in the mirror, take a posture picture, and help yourself to stand taller so you can live longer, move, feel, and be well.